to one goal, actually, from Boris Nikonorov. And here it was, very much a bit part player here in uh, Algero over the last uh, few days. Nikonorov, but uh, on the mark with that strike. One nil to Russia. And they held the lead from that point in time until the very last minute. And that was the second goal for the Russians. Zemskov halfway through the second period. Wonderful overhead from Zemskov. That was his ninth goal of the season. And that was Portugal's first, Nuno Belchior, the first of a hat-trick for him. With, uh, just about six minutes remaining. Meeting of Strovsky. And then there, with, uh, well, inside the last minute, Uno, believe it or not, three, Shishin echo. on the turn. Sent back to the net, the awkward bounce past Petroni, that was 3-1. Then back came Portugal. Belchior with 25 seconds left. Can we Come save it, he said to himself, after he uh, rammed home that free kick after clashing with Paparotti. Lo senti, lo lo senti. Parla, this, parla un po', with uh, sì. about four seconds sì. remaining, Jordan Santos, a free kick from the halfway line. He found okay. the back of the Perfetto. net, 3-3. Three, three. Okay. We're on our way to extra time. Ciao. What was that going to bring? Ciao. Well, another Russian goal. Petroni beating away, crashing in a cough strike, and Zemskov was there again. Goal number 10 of the season for him, but still back came Portugal. And how about that? Inside the last 20 seconds of extra time, Belchior completing his hat-trick. 4-4. And then we went to penalties. And this was the winning penalty from Jordan Santos. Frustration from Shushkov. Joy from the bench for Portugal.